And now what we did here in this graphic, we are trying to benchmark and compare the introduced technologies. And on the y-axis, you can find the reverse leakage currents and on the x-axis, the forward voltage drop. And first of all, short rectifiers are well known for their efficiency. They have a very low VF, but this always goes at the expense of accepting higher reverse leakage currents. And on that curve, um, with using a different Schottky barrier metal, different points on that curve can be achieved. Then we have our PN or recovery rectifiers. They usually have a higher VF value, um, but always extremely low um, IR values, which make them more stable over temperature. And last but not least, we have silicon germanium, and um, silicon germanium shows a very nice trade-off between a low VF and low reverse leakage characteristics.